problem number 31, we're asked to find all vertical asymptotes of this function, the function f of x equals x squared minus 9x plus 14 divided by x squared minus 5x plus 6. Now, when we go about um, figuring out where there are vertical asymptotes, what I want to do first is let's factor this thing completely. And then we're looking for what are the factors of x that show up on the bottom. So let's factor it completely first, and let's see what happens. So I factor this thing. And uh, if I'm factoring the top, I'm looking for two things that multiply uh, to give me positive 14 and add to give me minus 9. I suppose that that would be negative 2 and negative 7. And then on the bottom, I'm looking to find two things that multiply to give me positive 6 and add to give me negative 5. So I guess that would be x negative 2 and negative 3. So f of x factors to x minus 2 times x minus 7 over x minus 2 times x minus 3. Now, there's a real temptation right now to just say cross, cross, and cross off those minus 2s. But that's not really legal because we're not taking a limit right now. Uh, this is an actual function. And this represents something to me when I have this x minus 2 over x minus 2. What this tells me is at x equals 2, there's a hole in this graph, okay? Because there's an x minus 2 on the bottom, but there's also an x minus 2 on the top to, so to speak, cancel it out. That doesn't mean that there's a point at 2. That means that there's nothing at 2, but it's just a hole, okay? Now, the other factor that I have on the bottom of this fraction is x minus 3. And now I need to ask the question, is there an x minus 3 on the top? To cancel it out. In this case, the answer is no. There's no x minus 3 on the top to cancel out this x minus 3 on the bottom. And so something is happening here. This is representing my vertical asymptote. So there is one vertical asymptote on this problem, and it happens uh, when x minus 3 is 0. In other words, when x is equal to 3. So the vertical asymptote on this graph would be when x is equal to 3, or the equation of that vertical asymptote would be x equals 3.